Hey guys and welcome to my channel. In today's video, we're here in South Goa and I'm going to show you guys the world famous Kolva Beach. I'm going to show you guys the market. I'm going to show you guys the shacks, the water sports prices and everything that's happening here right now. So let's go and check out this beautiful beach here in South Goa. Okay guys, so we are starting off from here at the Kolva Circle. If you go to the road towards that side, that road takes you towards Banaulim. But what we are going to do is we are going to go on this road down the main street to the Kolva circle uh, which is the main circle and the Kolva beach so I'm actually sitting in the car today so we have uh, you know I got my driver with me today and we are going to go all the way down to the beach so I just wanted to show you guys like all the places that are here I'm going to show you guys the left hand side of the road while going and while coming back I will show you guys the right hand side of the road uh, which is the other side of the road so if you see here there's like all different shopping and everything available so if you see here there's a lot of international tourists right now so what happens is uh, this is like a popular place for international tourists <laughs> if you see you can see a little bit of my car in the front okay so just to give you guys like an idea of all the shops that are here there are cashew nut shops and you know there's wine stores and so many things like uh, something which I noticed quite a lot is that there are qu quite a few of these shops which have like jewelry and like precious semi precious stones and precious stones which is quite interesting and of course there's tattoo parlors and everything there's quite a lot of crowd it's around 11 30 in the morning but you know we're trying to go as slow as possible so you guys have a little look so just to give you guys an idea so this is the road like you know the main road area here and there's a big football ground on the left by the way that side so uh, today is a little gloomy day compared to usually I was hoping for a bright blue sunny skies but today is a slightly gloomy day but hopefully on the beach it'll be nice uh, so this area just leading up to the beach there is a lot of shopping that is available on this side of the road and of course both the sides of the roads have a lot of shopping here is this famous restaurant called goodman if you see there's a lot of international people for here for you know early breakfast it's not an early breakfast late breakfast but yeah guys so we are now into the main parking lot of the kolva beach area here and if you see here we can this is all parking area all around and it's so nice that you know there is so much of parking and if you see the amount of cars that are here means there's a lot of people on the beach which is a good uh, sign and good news from here so there are a couple of resorts also here which is Winley Beach Resort which is right there the one which is over there and we have made it to the beach area guys so if you see here there's quite a lot of uh, crowd here of course I'm shooting a little bit against the light so what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to uh, go out and show you guys so I'll come back in two minutes okay so more than two minutes <laughs> of course so let's enter into the beach area now and over there there is the Kolva residency that's a, a place if you want to stay they also have Longinos which is uh, around here so there are quite a few places uh, to stay in this area and Kolwa is a very popular area in the south of Goa here. If you see here on the bridge, they've made this really nice painting. So if you want to click photos here, you know, it is really nice. Sadly, people throw a lot of things around. So, you know, it's really sad. So guys, if you ever come to Goa, please keep Goa clean. So just to give you guys a look around here, so Kolwa, you know, in the evenings is like fully packed, but in the morning it's pretty decent. So they, this, we see the bridge here, they have renovated it recently. Wow, I'm back in Kolwa after such a long time, guys. So this is the little uh, water stream that goes into the sea. Uh, you do not want to go into this water, but look at this guys so it's a pretty nice day here even though it's not like really blue skies uh, I, I think it's going to 
probably rain. That is why, you know, I, I had seen the weather forecast and it said it is going to rain here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw off my slippers here because it's very difficult to walk with slippers on the sand. Sorry, I had to show you guys the sand for a second there. But just to give you guys a look around. So there's a lot of international tourists on that side of the beach there. But the beauty about South Goa, guys, is the sand here is like so fluffy, white, so soft. Means, you know, my legs just feel so nice walking here in the sand. Here we have water sports. And, you know, let's just go and check out the prices. And also, if you see the shacks are already built here. Of course, we are going against the light. But let me just uh, show you guys. So we'll just look this side and show you guys. So, all the water sports counters are here. So, I'm going to show the water sports prices here. So, there's a counter here and it's showing you all the prices. So, these are the prices for water sports, guys, if you want to take any of the water sports option. So, if you see here, uh, package is clear. Package All individual, okay. So, this is all the uh, prices over here. Uh, this is the counter that you have to come to and just to show you guys so uh, Kolwa does not have uh, this thing packages compared to uh, like North Goa they have like these packages which you can get all the water sports in North Goa but here it is just uh, you know individual which I just showed you so what we'll do is I'll just go in front and show you guys the shacks Okay guys, so as you can see the shacks are fully done up here and they are fully operational So if you ever come to South Goa, you know everything is op fully operational here for the Kolwa beach Over here you have beach beds By beach bed ka price kya hai? Yeah. Kitna leta hai beach bed ke liye? 200 for a, a one hour, okay. So they charge you 200. And if you are eating at the shack, either khara hai to free, free, acha, okay. So if you are eating at the shack, then the beach bed is completely free. Uh, if uh, you want only to sit on the beach bed, then it is 200 rupees per hour. So I think it would be a smart move to, you know, eat at the shack. So get some couple of beers here and you know eat at the shack so as you can see the crowd has just come in there's quite a lot of people here and it's so good to see that we have so many people here so just to give you guys an idea if you see here there is like this little swimming pool like area here which is really nice for kids you know kids will love it because it's so shallow here wow oh my god the water is ice cold it is so so cold guys so wow i love i love south goa guys it's so majestic here even though it looks like it's going to rain a little while but you know even then it's just so beautiful so we have so many international tourists everywhere you go as you can see here and what we'll do is let's just take a little walk down the beach and show you guys the crowds huh so they're asking if i want to do the you know jet ski thing so this is the speed boat here and what the speed boat wow let's walk into the water this is so amazing uh that feeling and what happens is if you see i don't know if you can see but they have like a little crunchy shells which have like a little broken shells but like when you walk here it just gives you like this nice foot massage and there is like small small fish swimming around here which is really nice so anyway this is the speedboat and the speedboat takes you all the way there and when you reach there then they take you for the parasailing which is really nice here they also have the beach photographers that are around and the beach photographers they charge you 50 rupees for a photo and let me just show you so these are the beach photographers here and they charge you 50 rupees for a nice photo like this so they'll take your photo like that and print it out straight away and give it to you so they even tell you how to do the poses here which is pretty nice so see they have this camera and see now he'll tell them how to do the pose here so yeah 
she is even telling them, look at that side, then look this side. And <laughs> that's very interesting. So if you see the side, this side, I, I don't really know if you can see my camera screen is turned off. But just to give you guys a complete glimpse around, I hope it is nice and bright. But yeah, it's so nice. And there are lo lots of these shacks that side of the beach in the sense like at the end of the beach there so the water is just so calm and relaxing see how he's running into the sea so nice so over here you see there are no big waves in Polva beach so you know it is so nice when you can go right up there and if you see the people which are here you know look at that so the waves are very small and you know everybody can swim really nicely here so what we'll do is let me go back there and show you guys the jet skis now okay guys so look at that so that is the jet ski right here they take you for a fascinating round over here and the way they take it over here is pretty nice so let us just check out the jet ski when they take the people what a feeling it's like so they don't allow you to ride it on your own they just put you there and then somebody will ride it and give you guys like a full round. So anyway, we'll just watch how they take the person out here. So it looks really cool guys. So I'm in the, literally in the water here. So let us see the full experience how they go. And hopefully we get to see the timing also. So you guys have an idea of how long they take the person for here. Wow, look at that. See the speed they're going. So, <laughs> I think it went off. <laughs> okay. So, let's just see how far they take you. So, in like North Goa, they take you like for a, just a small round. Uh, no offense to North Goa, but wow, they went so far. So, here they're taking you for like a really, really big round, which is so, so far. So, if you're coming to South, I would definitely tell you to, you know, take a jet ski ride here. Look at how far they went. And when they come back, they're going to do like this, uh, like tricks and, you know, different things over here. So I'm looking forward to seeing how they do that. So if you see here also, that's pretty nice, guys. Look at the, how far they went. So look at this, okay? So they're going to come like, oh, wow, look at that. Look at this. That is awesome, guys. So, yeah, such a big round and yeah so this is the jet ski ride here and wow very interesting so what we'll do is now let's go back to the other side and show you guys from there okay so we are continuing to walk on the beach here as you can see there's lots of families and you know so many people from all over but just to show you guys another type of water sports that is here is this bumper boat ride so they take two people in this bumper boat so you can sit over here it is basically they fill it up with air like this over here and then you know what they do is they tie you to this and they take you at high speed into the sea and you know it's like basically you have to hold on for dear life there are two uh, handles here and yeah it's a fun fun experience so if you ever come here of course you'll really enjoy this so yeah guys this is uh, the Kolva beach area. Now what we'll do is let me show you guys the other side of the market from back there. Okay guys, so we are going back and I'm just showing you guys the other side of the market area right now as well as you know this is the parking lot area but if you see there there are quite a few restaurants here and just to show you guys over there is the tourist facilitation center so if you ever you know have any issues or you want to talk to uh, the tourist police or anything you can always go to the tourist information center and they'll help you there's also a washroom over here which is the you know main washroom they have a big washroom here so even if you want to have a bath uh, you can have a bath and the urinals and everything so just to show you guys on the left here there's quite a lot of clothing and shopping available just a close-up look at the things that are available here the road which takes you to the left here has like a lot of international tourists in this area there i was just there for uh, you know just for around that side and there was quite a lot of people there so what we are going to do is of course we are going to go back to the 
circle area but if you see here they have so many bikinis and you know so many things available which is pretty nice so if you want to do some shopping when you're here and you know i'm not used to shooting with a car so it's a little different experience i usually do it on the bike so it's very easy for me but today we are trying out something different hopefully it turns out good but here is portifino which is a restaurant there there is see the jewelry places that are here guys it's so big and look at this this is like this amazing market uh, over here what i'll do is i'll just give you guys a round of this market i'm just going to get out of the car for a second and show you guys like the market area here so if you have like an idea of what what is available and hopefully there are so what are the prices so over here hi what are the prices of the dresses so here you can come and meet her uh, yeah what kind do you like no from starting what is the starting price 450 then, then. So five hundred. This is six fifty. Like and this kind of okay. I'll give discount okay. So we'll give discount also. also okay. So I'll just give you guys a little look at all the out outfits that they have here. So if you see, they have many different types of dresses here, and uh, they have these white dresses. The color white dress. Yeah, and white dress. This you can get more design. Okay. okay. And, and this is one half. Okay. These are the prices. Are how much? Uh, this is eight fifty. Eight fifty. And this. this? Also have same price. This. This. Okay. Is the same price. Okay. These are all eight fifty. And the smaller, shorter dresses. So what is it, How much? Six fifty. Six fifty. Yeah. Okay. White dress. Huh? Okay, the white dresses are yeah. six fifty. So and this one is four fifty. Okay. And what about those? Uh, yeah. Okay. This one is six fifty yeah. for the set. Yeah, this is three okay, three pieces. Okay. Oh yeah, it's a bikini kind of top. It's a crop top. And okay, so there are different prices. What about the men's outfits over here? Men's is five fifty. Five fifty. Yeah. Okay. So we what's your name? Sushmita. Sushmita. Okay. So if you guys come here, you got Sushmita. You can meet her <laughs> over here at her shop. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. Okay. Just thank you so much. Please yeah. Care. Okay. Buy huh? So, huh? No, I'm just showing everybody what the ah, available okay. items are here. So if you see, yeah. So she'll give good price, she's saying. So over here, if you see, there are different bags and everything. So bags ka price. Wow. So the, you saw that? So that was, do it again, do it again. So the, that's like, a, look, that's like a trumpet, but it's just out of a shell, guys. Wow. So nice. Uh, what are the bag prices? What is the starting prices of bags over here? Thousand. thousand rupees for those then the smaller ones this one is 650 650 and these 800 what about this thousand and the caps 300, 200. okay from 200 onwards okay so thank you so much so if you see here guys they have so many types of bags and everything available there are slippers so this is like a big market here and they have so many so many so many outfits over here so if you ever come here you have like so many options and you can always you know check them out so this is the main shopping area here and of course what we are going to do is let's continue and show you guys so that's my car here but i brought this car today so i have two civics this one and the new model civic as well okay chalo we'll go in front but yeah this is the market if you ever come here then you have this option of uh, shopping from here so it was so nice that they told us all the prices and of course there's atm here if you ever want to take out money there's like a, a sugarcane guy here so you know you get to have a nice refreshing sugarcane juice on a hot day here there are like these wow they have such nice those little bit of you know those earrings and jewelry here there's a nice hotel here called the hotel silva rosa on on the left here so it's very close to the beach and see this is the prop i don't know if you can see the property but yeah okay that's the property there so it looks pretty new decent looking place something that i noticed here is a lot of the international tourists are roaming around with cycles so somewhere out here they have like cycles for rent which is available which is pretty nice so these are like the houses here so i'm giving you guys a full perspective from here and yeah so the weather is humid as well as 
like pretty okay like so if you're riding a bike or anything it's pretty decent but if you're like standing around it can get quite uh, you know sweaty which is very surprising for this time of the year but yeah here you have zantes guys zantes is like this okay so they have zantes there which is this famous casual shop available here there are many of these casual shops but zantes is like the og original famous casual shop uh you know for casual nuts uh here you have a nice salon little small salon here and you have wow momos guys so we are back to the main uh, kolwa circle here and yeah guys so that is it from here in kolwa so guys that is it from here in kolwa i hope you enjoyed this video please do like and subscribe and i'll be bringing you guys lots of other videos from here in goa